We're back at Rusty's, Pete, and it's opening of Minnesota deer hunting. Yeah, and you can see I got the proper attire on. <laughs> All set to go. Yeah, okay. and I finally get to meet Pete. I'm Randy Hagen, friend of Rusty's. Yeah, it's a so. pleasure. I've heard about this guy. He got himself a buck, so. First buck. Yeah. yeah that is true. Might First just buck. be a spike, but, you know, Rusty says, hey, if it comes by, go ahead and shoot it. So, <laughs> so I did. You took instructions. Yes. That's important. There's a legend right here. <laughs> How's it going, bud? Good, good. Randy got a couple turkeys and now he's got a buck. Yep. We're just putting a boat in the water, Dave. This is not a filmable moment. Where are we going today? Going musky fishing. Where? What do you mean, where? <laughs> we're, we're somewhere in Minnesota, dude. I only tell you where if we catch something. Otherwise, you don't need to know, Dave. All right. Yeah. Why you got that thing right up in my face here? I can't even see the Frickin' rock. Dave's gonna make me drive into a rock, everybody. Pete, oh buddy, tell us who we got with us today, my friend. Well, uh, we have your buddy Tom, who I just met, so I don't know all that much about him. I can't say anything good, can't say anything bad. We got Riley Hansen up here, who will be with us part-time, as I understand. He I can attest to a little bit more. I kind of like him. He's a young guy, fishes hard all the time, pretty good at it. I like to talk to him about what's going on over here in Minnesota. He says we may catch one. so. We're definitely gonna try, and I think we're gonna catch one. I'm here for moral support, keeping everybody thinking, keeping their brains active. That's my job. <laughs> you do such a fine job. I do, yeah. Someone's gotta keep these guys in, in order. And uh, you just give them a couple of quizzes throughout the day, make sure they're thinking. Make sure the guy up front's thinking, because he's a lead man. Make sure his brain is active, working. Hey, you know, I just thought of something to say. Go ahead. A lot of people make fun of my hat. Yeah, me and, including. Yeah, 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 and looking at yours right now, I don't know if that's a stupider hat by far. It is my personal opinion. Well, now your personal opinion. Well, my personal opinion of yours too, but that's the world we live in now. Everyone's kind of going after everybody. So, opinionated. Yeah, opinionated. <laughs> well, all good here. We're having fun. We like Pete's hat. We know that's who Pete is. So, even though it is a little silly. <laughs> Oh, oh nice. <laughs> that a boy. That's a good one. Man. Woo. That's Shit. a good fish. Woo. Just saw the big mouth open. Oh, oh. I kind of love that. Yeah, I hope I'm, I hope I'm in Pete's good graces now. Not gonna lie, I thought, I thought we were talking 52 when I first man, saw it. You gotta be kidding me. Congrats, man. Thanks, bud. Nicely done. Thank you. Nicely done. That is a beautiful fish. I just got to say this while he's struggling here. I, <laughs> I, I didn't really know about Tom, but now I really like Tom. <laughs> Anybody that catches a big muskie is 
just fine by me. This fish does not want to come in the boat right now. He's still. Oh, oh yeah. That's, that's a big <laughs> fish, dude. That's a beauty. That is a beauty. <laughs> Let's see if I can get a the Pete Mana selfie. I always try and do a selfie. That's good. Well, hold them out, a big oh, guy you like go. you, nah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> that is a dandy, Tom. Big fish. Yeah, that's a beautiful. tank. Nice job, dude. Let's, uh, got your... Yeah, yeah, pull it. He's ready. And away she goes. Beautiful. Well, it's cool to be able to see her. Swimming I can see away. her swimming that's away. At awesome. So here we are, we got, in the fall, a lot of tight windows, Pete. <laughs> a lot of tight windows. Uh, we got one shot, we actually moved two fish and what we figured was the tail end of the miner and we capitalized, that's the main thing, eh, bud? Yeah, absolutely, and, and it is really a good point, to be honest with you, that, you know, people talk for years about the fall feed bag and you know they're yep. most most of the time they're not wearing that backpack I mean it, in reality <laughs> it's you don't see many fish this time of the year but usually they mean business when you do and in a lot of cases it will be a pretty tight window either on weather or moon yep so we've got the next few days we're looking uh, we're pretty optimistic after that 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 warmed everybody's blood up a little bit everybody warmed up and yeah. it's awful cool we're right at about 33 34 degrees i would say so right now and, water uh, temperature 39 right now maybe we can stick one more out tonight here and uh, if not we'll be back tomorrow chugging away doing what we do chugging second. Sweet to be sad to see that one go. I was kind of surprised we didn't keep it. We could have had that one for breakfast tomorrow. Actually, we probably should have kept it. Everything is just good and different, and we're all positive, and everyone's in a good mood. What could be wrong with our attitude today? It's all going to be good. Look at the pink hats going yeah. on. Well, hey. Yeah. Okay. Oh, oh, wait. I got a pair of glasses up there. All right, here we go. Now the attitude's better. That is one ugly hat you're wearing, though. I still say that. So it's day three, we are on a new lake and Pete chose this lake because the wind is gonna be heavy. We couldn't get out on leech today. So we're going on a smaller inland lake. The winds are gonna be blowing, but we are going to be hopefully on them today. We've been having short windows. One in the afternoon, you get about one shot at it, right Pete? One shot's been it. One, one follow, one shot. Although technically I think we had two follows. First, first evening, but bubbles. whatever. Yeah, only one bite. You get about a half hour to 45 minutes to make it happen, and we had our buddy Big Tom make it happen. Tom's been fishing with me for a long time. He's caught a lot of nice fish with me. We'll show you some of them big fish he's caught over the years. I'm 
come grab them for you? <laughs> He's got this gill thing going on. I want to make sure I'm not, I'm not grabbing that. I think this fish has been caught before where it's got a little bit of gill damage. <clears throat> I'm trying to be very cautious about not grabbing it. She's, she's pretty ornery. She's not happy that she's been caught. Oh. There we go. Nice blonde beauty. Solid fish. Put up a nice tussle. Like I said, smoked the bucktail about three quarters of the way in. Boom, all over it. Yeah, we usually do pretty good. Good average, I would say. Probably mid 40s over the, I don't know, is it eight, nine years or so? Tight. Yep. Oh, big fish, Dave. Coming around. Oh my keep gosh. Snug, keep her snug, keep her snug. Keep her snug. I can't. Keep I'm at the wait. I'm at the wait. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Woo. Yeah. oh man, that fish. Monster fishing in that way. You guys see this fish. We've been out here for a couple of hours, casting, casting bulldogs, dragon suckers. We've seen this, we've seen this fish chasing a sucker before. Circle back around, swallowed it. Fish in the bag. Super pumped. What do you guys see this fish? Thick, solid fish. Probably a four footer. Amazing fall fish. That's why we're out here doing this. Uh, freezing cold. Not cold anymore. <laughs> dug and dug and dug. Didn't yeah, want to come to the, the boat. Look at the size of the. Uh, she's build on her man it's just a beautiful fish we're gonna let her go here Amazing. we're gonna take a couple snaps we're gonna put her back in the in the water and let her relax and then we'll take a couple quick picks and yeah. get, get get that done eh? yeah let's get back at all it all right man long suffering man right there <laughs> can you believe I, you know i like him i just met him on this trip but uh i really his judgment and friends and guides i don't know if <laughs> That's real good, but he sticks with it. He's just one of those guys that never quits. Not quitting on Dave. So, so he says that I'm tough to get along with. I don't know about <laughs> that. You got an ugly hat. Everybody can see it right now. Yeah, you? that's all right. I don't let it bother me. Just go out there and grind away. Listen to some crap along the way. We're here for one reason and one reason only, and that's to get a giant, right? And on this body of water. <laughs> yeah. No, that's it. And, and uh, you know, I've talked about that before to a certain extent. You know, you always hear the, the fall of the year, the fall feed bag on and this, that, and the other. But it's, in reality, I don't think they actually eat as much this time of the year. They are a cold-blooded animal, and obviously their metabolism is a lot slower this time of the year. They're carrying egg weight and and obviously eating too but that's why they're so tubby but they definitely don't eat all day it's kind of a low density deal this time of the year and definitely a uh, well low window I mean you're you know in a lot of days you're pretty happy with one shot but if you get a great big one that's a deal come out here and suffer we're definitely not here looking for a 36 incher uh, we're hoping to get that well 56 incher let's go big Dave Love it. Pete, that's a wrap. Four days. We ended up catching one big one though. Yeah, we did. Uh, 
Pete's not very happy right now. We had kind of the final kick was getting blown off the lake. I don't know where exactly the wind is at right now, but uh, it's pretty lumpy out there. It's actually picking up. Yes. We got in right, right in time. <laughs> <laughs> We've rolled. 